yeah, so I came here this week because I've been having back pain and bad sciatica, and I'd come to see Dr. Books previously, and she had been touching my body very gently, and I got very emotional, and I didn't understand why, and she told me that she felt like there was a story or some trauma uh, trapped in my in my body or my nervous system that was causing the recurrence of this low back pain that while there was physical things to be dealt with that there was also energetic or emotional things that needed to be released to prevent this from continuing into the future and so maybe I came hoping that by the end of it I would be totally pain free but I'm mostly pain free by the way but um what actually happened was uh, a, a, a sea change, a sort of shift in, in perspective where, whereby I can accept that I'm on the path to recovery and it's changed the way I've looked at things. It's removed the fear, it's removed the anxiety, it's removed the pessimism or doubt of full health and helped me appreciate that all of this was for a purpose yeah well i thought <clears throat> i thought that maybe what i was looking for was to be free of pain which of course i was on on some level but what happened is a much much deeper and much more profound shift which is to understand and not just as an intellectual idea but to fully embody the truth that that perhaps the pain was there calling me towards a shift in perspective, like a shift in how I see things, a shift in seeing the world as obstacles and threats and, you know, potential pitfalls and maybe I'll never be out of pain and all the doubt and fear and anger that can cause and then feeling like I've suddenly grown twice as tall. And looking down on the things that used to seem problematic and they don't anymore and understanding that like all of this is just an invitation for my own growth and I'm not being punished that the pain can be resolved once I understand what it's trying to tell me and that my body is my friend and it's all okay and you know it, it, it's such a it's such a it, it's an intensely deeper and much more holistic kind of feeling because I've had back pain and gotten out of pain before and then gone right back. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, this is very, very special. And so I leave here very happy and very peaceful and uh, with a new friend. Oh, that's beautiful. The pain, the pain suddenly becomes such a, such a side character. You, you understand, like, it's not... I mean, it was really bad and it was all consuming. And then the only thoughts it was generating were like, how do I stop this pain? What have I done to deserve this pain? Can I live in this pain for so long? I can't take it. This isn't fair. This is blah, blah, blah. No one can help me. To all of a sudden, just a, the pain is now just like a, like a sort of whispered echo of, of what happened as it sort of fades. And it's not, it's not um, like I've received its message. And therefore it can, it can relax, you know, it can relax. And it also doesn't mean what I thought it meant, you know, like if there's meaning in something, then it suddenly immediately changes its quality, right? Versus this sort of pain that feels meaningless and you don't understand what you did to deserve it or what you did wrong or how you can fix your body. And it's so defeating and makes you feel like a victim and you know it, it doesn't never done anyone any good but but in this way it's empowering it's like oh my body's trying to tell me something because it wants the best for me and you know yeah and seeing things from the higher level i mean it literally had like such a, a clear image of of just certain people and things i've been sort of negotiating in my life recently and kind of looking any way I look, they're all sort of here and literally in the last few days growing two or three times as, as tall and then having that same visual and looking down and seeing them and being this big, it's like, oh, they're, they're harmless. And also like, you could just like, just gently move them aside if, if you want, yeah. you know, and, and, and also just seeing everything that way, like, 
just even my schedule coming up for the next month or two turned into like, oh, I need time to take care of myself too. Oh, what a, what a great adventure. And every part of that will have opportunities for me to take care of myself. Mm -hmm. that, 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 that my idea of how things need to go has never been very good. So like, <laughs> could I just surrender to how things are going and say yes to life and like in so doing that there's no more accidents and that all of it is healing and for my benefit, which is, which is, which is the most radical healing of all is heal your mind. Yeah. Totally.